Namaste. Today let us discuss about UTI, urinary tract infection. This is an infection caused in the urinary system which includes uh, kidney, bladder and urethra. I know that there are thousands of people out there those are suffering from UTI, especially women. Today let us discuss how it is caused, why it is caused, what are the symptoms and how it can be treated well through the natural process. See, the main reason for UTI is bacteria. Okay. Sometimes fungus, but mainly bacteria. You know that there are a lot of bacteria in our anal region, genital region and vaginal region. So what happens when these bacteria enters from the anal region to the urethra openings and they travel all the way to the bladder and then they causes this UTI infection. See, this is very common for both men and women, but mostly women suffer a lot because of the anatomical structure. Let me show you. See, look at this. This is the female anatomical structure and this is the male anatomical structure. See, there are bacteria in the anus region. Okay. And if you observe the urethra in women, it is very short and it is very close to the anal region. So the bacteria is here and in the vaginal opening, they easily enters into this urethral opening, but it is differing. It's completely different in uh, male, right? So that is why this is the one of the main reason why women suffer a lot from this UTI infection. There are many reasons for UTI infection. One, it might be constipation problem is one and uncontrolled diabetics, start using certain types of birth control products, dehydration, using a lot of chemical feminine products, kidney stones, menophers, and using unhygienic uh, undergarments. There might be many causes and also sexual activities. Basically, uh, sex will not cause you this UTI, but it might trigger the UTI in women. See what happens during sex when bacteria from your partner's genital region or uh, anus region or in the fingers, uh, it can get pushed into the urethra and this might be the causes. Even if you don't have intercourses also, just by fingering and oral sexes can also lead to this infection. That is why it is better to say no to sex during this UTI. Okay. And also, you know, the common cause, have you heard that people keep on saying at home, did you use the public toilet? Maybe you got the UTI from there. See, just by using the public toilet, you will not get the UTIs because, you know, the bacteria will not fly directly to the urethra opening when you're using the public toilet but sometimes what happens there might be bacteria on the seat of this public toilet and it might have come in contact with your skin or your you know inner wear and then later it might have traveled all the way to the urethra opening and then to the bladder and then it might cause the infection see the symptoms of UTIs differ from person to person but Common symptoms are you will be frequently urinating and sometimes you feel like going to urine but the bladder is completely you know empty and you might feel a burning sensation during the urination and cloudy urine uh, and also very bad smell during urination. Urine leakage can happen, lower back pain, uh, you know, lower back pain can happen, pelvic area pain can happen. And also, you know, sometimes urine color might be like a reddish color, pink color, you know, these are all the symptoms. But remember, if the UTI spreads all the way to the kidney, which is very serious, then the symptom might be like a fever, upper back pain, uh, nausea and vomiting. Then you really need to consult your doctor immediately when you have these kinds of symptoms. Now, there are many natural ways to get rid out of this UTI. So one very common is drinking plenty of water. Keep drinking plenty of water and eat more probiotic like uh, curd rice, mosrana and lassi without sugar and drink lots of uh, coconut water. This also helps a lot and also try to increase the garlic in your diet. You know, the garlic and if you don't like the flavor nowadays, the garlic capsules are available easily so you can take the garlic and also you can use uh, early morning in empty tummy take a glass of warm water drop two drops of uh, organic uh, oil uh, sorry oregano oil you know dodda patre oil okay if you don't have this oil it's okay you can just start shaving two or three oregano leaf also this will also helps a lot and important wash the genital area regularly with homemade curd masro okay na? regularly every two to three hours keep on washing the genital area using the masro uh, the curd and also you can wash with uh, baking soda in warm water. You can also use antifungal soap and also you can use uh, neem uh, soap, you know, very commonly available nowadays. So you can use the neem soap and also after the poo poo, you know, after you finish your poo poo while you're washing your uh, anal region, try to wash from front to back. Don't wash from back to front. When you're washing from back to front, you are basically pulling the bacteria towards the urethra right so try to wash from front to back this is important and also after having sex it's very important to empty your bladder okay don't keep your bladder full empty your bladder and also ds please check with your partner because she or he might be suffering from this uti and they are gifting you this regularly okay so check with your partners also 
frequently keep on changing your inner ways and try to wear the loose inner ways okay and remember especially if you're pregnant and if you're suffering from this uti from more than one or two weeks then immediately you need to run to the doctor you need to take a proper precautions okay and at last i would like to say that cleanliness is the key keep your genital area as much as possible clean and dry as much as possible and also your immune system strong by following the healthy yogic lifestyle okay so these are all about uti i hope you got some information about uti be happy and be healthy and any questions please comment below and also don't forget to share this i know it's a very long video but the subject is very long so don't forget to share the video thank you namaste